So like I've stepped into something that I've <clears throat> only dreamed of. I feel humbled and I feel the most alive I've ever felt in my life. This is Warrior X Talks, where you will witness those who have lived the warrior's way live. And during these episodes, you understand. This is a brotherhood. What is it, man? together as men who choose to do life a different way that different way is not always easy but damn is it good This is your product. This is the ball. Don't drop it. How easy to play ball with someone who's asleep. You can't, right? But you try to. This is why your marketing is not working. This this will not hurt. This will not hurt. You are safe, I promise. Or is he? This is what you guys look like right now in your marketing. You're like, I got the ball. I'm ready. I want you guys to spin around. Spin. Spin, not spin the ball, spin. Now take three steps. Okay, now I'm going to lay down. I'm asleep. Now what I want you to do is pass me the ball. On three, in a moment you're gonna throw the ball. Not hard, but you're just gonna pass it, okay? In three, two, one, pass me the ball. Don't take it off, don't take it off, don't take it off. You wanna know the difference between wearing a bucket on your head and not having a bucket on your head? You want to know? As soon as you start caring, the difference between being blind and spinning around is thinking marketing, technology, and advertising is going to be the key. But what the key is, you fucking care. The commodity of care has been forgotten. And so you spin around. But that's, 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 that's guys who are in business. Most of the time, here's what's actually going down. I got this idea. I see it. Okay. And then you spend a couple months. I still got this idea. And then finally you come to a conference like this and you're like, you know what, fine, picking this ball up, okay? I got my idea, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna live my passion and calling. And then you know what you don't do? You don't dribble. You know why Garrett got so good? You know why, though I get credit for videos, he would have done it with any videographer. You know why? Because he spent 16 years doing what? Dribbling the 
Long ball. Video. Video. Message. Message. Deploy. 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 And then, after he'd lost everything, I was like, hey, I'm broke. Two grand a month is a lot for me. I know how to design and do videos. He's like, great. Let's go. And he had spent 16 years doing what? Dribbling. And how many of you guys are dribbling right now? How often are you dribbling? Because reps make a good basketball player, right? I'm not a basketball player. I can throw the ball around, but this guy's a basketball player. What made you great? Repetition, sorry. So if you guys want to get good, you have to start by caring about the people that you're about to serve. And then you are awake. If I don't care about this guy, what happens? What potentially happens to him literally with this ball? I hurt him. I annoy him. I bother him. I disrespect him. If I keep doing this, eventually, thank you, he's not even within my grasp. I can't even pass it. Technology has allowed a lot of people who are just laying down for you to just throw balls at. But you're not going to get someone to pass it back if they're just lying down. So what we have to do is to wake them up. And we don't wake them up with our product. Right? Hey, give me money. Luckily that didn't uh, hurt him. What do we have to do? We had to get down to where they are. What Mr. Rogers did with the kids. And simplify. Say, hey. Hey, what's up, man? How's it going? Now he sees me, right? Is he ready to play ball? No. This is the part of feeling that's so important, okay? You guys getting this? And then when he's, hey, get up. What's up, man? You wanna play ball? All right, let's play some ball. Someone throw me a ball. I got this product, it can help you. Check it out. You wanna give me some money for it? Cool, man, thanks. And that is how you make money. What we're gonna create is an asleep message. The first, the tip of the spear message that you must have is an asleep message. There's three things that we have to consider. First one is emotion. Second one is desire. And the third is logic. You see the, the, how it's going clockwise? Emotion is where you begin. Desire is where you immediately have to go. You immediately have to make it relevant. Otherwise, it's per it's, there's point like, they'll forget about it. You have to understand their desire, okay? And the next piece is logic. Put the screen back up. Why logic? Because it has to be practical. Otherwise, it's just like emotion. Bum, bum, bum. Go to the moon. Someone's always wanted to go to the moon. All you got to do is build your own rocket. Okay, well, I'm not going to do that. So you have to introduce logic. Logic is how to give someone your product so that it actually solves their problem. Sometimes you get so excited about your product, that it, but it doesn't actually create the solution. Because you just think it was. Because we have the ball. We have the curse of knowledge, remember? So we're just so excited that we're ready to deploy that we forget if it's actually going to be as effective as it could. So we have to go to logic. But if the feeling that you know, <clears throat> watching this right now, real time, right here, and you know that there's something that is uh, knocking, you've been searching for a long time, this is the place. Now, if you're listening to this, that means 
What you just watched resonated with you somehow, some way. And now you want to learn more. So here's what I need you to do. Go to warriorcon4.com right now, right now. Cause, cause, Cause when it comes to training married businessmen with children, let me tell you something. We run this, we run it, we run this, we run it, we run this, we run it, we run this motherfucker. You gotta fight every day, every night.